in this video i am going to talk about first we have done the outgoing email now we are going to talk about other details as well like what is mail queue so mail queue is nothing but your server is sending notification to the users okay so in some reasons there are some errors are there and uh, the mail got stuck so you can see those stuck email under error queue okay and if there is mail queue and there are just uh, think uh, there are uh, 20000 users are there and simultaneously 5000 users are using they are making the changes so it will send the notification so that queue could be a uh, like 5000 uh, or 500 emails in a one time so you can see those mail queue under here so user can complain hey i, I am updating this thing but i am not getting any email why so you can come here and you can check it out okay just go down send email if you want to send any email to any of the user or project role like i want to send in email to this group okay come here uh, let's try this magic one which role i want to send i want to send admin just provide your details go down and click on send so it's kind of bulk email send for a specific project like there is any changes are there you are going to change you going are going to delete the project or whatever you can select this thing and you can send i don't want to send notification to the all the user i just want to send any project roles or specific groups so i can select like jira test i can draw write out write down the email and click on send so this mail notification will be sent let's see another option matching email notification so what is this so it's uh, nothing but i will show you see let's save 2 minutes okay what is the meaning of this one uh, okay like if you are making any changes in your system like uh, create i am creating the ticket under jira test project request some ticket anything anything is fine go down click on create okay so there is one operation which which is done creating the so this is one event or one operation you can say let it create and after that if you have disabled this batch email notification so what will happen it will send the notification one by one okay i will show you right now it's enabled you can see in every 2 minutes now i am changing the status to in progress my bad closed i have closed the ticket just go down add comment hello world go down click on add okay so what i have done i have done three things okay what are the three things i have done i have created the ticket i have changed uh, the status i have commented on the the ticket so three things i have done i will get in one email one single email all these three things when i will get this notification in the 2 minutes so and uh, if it's disabled then i will going, i am going to get a uh, three emails okay one for creating the ticket one for uh, changing the status one for commenting so sometimes your user can say hey i am not getting the notification or why notification is this much of late so you can check if it's uh, how much time you have given if you have given 1 hour so after 1 hour whatever changes have happened in one of the ticket it will send the notification okay so it totally depends on you so let's wait for 2 minutes after that i will get the notification i will show you okay go down let's see another option 
email templates this is incoming email i will create another video for it this is a big topic email templates this is your email template if you want to revert to default just click on revert to default revert so this is the default one only if you want to give any uh, specific template you can upload the template if you want to download the template you can download as well so it's totally up to you how you want to check your email templates okay how you want to send the email one thing i have created this ticket and your user is created the ticket and uh, they are selling like hey i am not getting the notification why what happened why i am not getting the notification they can ask a number of questions they can ask right so in that scenario what you can say you can just go to admin click on notification helper just provide the user uh, name what event you want if you created notification is not getting just click on submit it's not sending the notification because no notification is set i have done the three things but i'm not getting the notification so just click on add on default notification click on associate i have done the changes as you can see i should get the email but i am i was not getting the email so like this you can check it out now let's do the changes again go down click on create change it go down assign to me now go down again click on add comment go down click on add like this i am going to add multiple things i will get the notification in the 2 minutes so just let's wait for 2 minutes so we got this email i got this email and you can see all the three things which i have changed like i have created the notification it's there the updates and the comments all the three things are there in the one email so this is the user batch notification if we are not using the batch notification it's not going to happen you will get three email for the same changes okay thank you for watching